Welcome to the System Verilog interview series. This question has been used in real technical interviews and it covers forks and threads. And this question is going to be in two parts because uh, you'll need to solve part one uh, before you can do part two. So let me explain the question here. Uh, we have three tasks here, A, B, and C. And uh, the first task basically runs for 50 microseconds. And uh, every one microsecond it, uh, it displays uh, a statement. Task B uh, basically runs for 5 microseconds and it displays finished after it's done. Task C similar to task B but runs for 10 microseconds and displays once it's done. Uh, so if you have the following code down here you've got uh, a task and then a, a fork with a join none to run um, task A and then a fork with a join any to run um, B and C. Basically how much time is going to elapse before we hit this display statement over here? That's the first question. Um, the second question is actually when we execute this disabled fork down here, which of the above three tasks uh, will get killed, if any? Um, so go ahead and uh, think about that and I'll cover the answer uh, as well as the next question. Uh, in the next part.